Hi everyone and welcome back to the Milcom YouTube channel. Today we're gonna make a little studio talk even though we're outside and we're gonna talk about my two Schmeisser AR15, the AR15 and the AR15-9, J9 mm and what I did to those two rifles over the last two years. So take a closer look. So let's start with this one, the newer one. Um, this is the AR-15-9, chambered in 9mm, and I did not do much to this one. I changed the foregrip to the one I like more than the standard one, and I changed the muzzle brake to this one, so I can use the silencer um, due to the fact that I like to shoot this rifle silenced. Otherwise, I shot this one probably for 4,000 um, rounds right now without any problem. It feeds well even from different ammunition and I really had a lot of fun even though it is a pistol um, cartridge carbine and it don't have that much mass which I bring down the target. But this one is rather standard. I did not do a lot of change to this one so we're gonna leave that to this sign. Let's talk about this one. This was the first project we did together with Schmeisser in 2019 and we sold them really quickly and there will be a new project with Schmeisser coming up this year. So if you are watching this one and you want to get one of these new Schmeisser AR-15s version, you should definitely check out our Instagram or message us so we can update you. Um, as you can tell, this one had some uh, modifications. First of all, I got a booster due to the fact that I wanted to shoot this rifle over 100 meters. I put on this B3X um, LE Falke booster and um, which allows me to shoot further. I got rid of the Norek compensator due to the fact that I really didn't love it. Um, the Norek is really fun for me to shoot, don't get me wrong. It compensates really good and it makes a lot of fun for me to shoot but everyone next to me hated it, so I changed it um, to the threaded one from ATAC due to the fact that now I can mount my ATAC flow and shoot it silenced without, uh, with and without silencer. I also got the new um, gas block from Schmeisser, the adjustable gas block. There are 12 different positions I can put in there, um, so I'm able to switch it if I'm silenced or non-silenced and that works without any problem. I got the new safety, the 45 degrees safety, which is a German safety. I can put it on safe, even though the rifle is not um, charged, which is in my opinion, really beneficial for this rifle. We also had this safety on the new um, Schmeisse AR-15 9 mm but I put it in there too. I got also the new trigger in here, the two-stage trigger from Schmeister, works also without any problem. The newest thing you can see and tell is probably this one. This is the prototype of the Schmeisser PDW um, personal defense weapon um, stock, which is collapsible, um, like from the APC PDW. Um, really nice one, I tested it. First, I thought it looks not that great. It looks like a little Ock boot, which is black, but after shooting it several times, I really can tell you, it is a really nice product and a really nice thing to shoot. It is shorter than the actual package. It's around six centimeters, which we gain here. Uh, makes it really nice, compact. Um, due to the fact that I'm rocking the silencer, it will be a bit longer um, even though. But otherwise, really nice and compact system. And you should definitely get your hands on one of these if you want to. The newest version of the um, Milcomp Edition 2.0, which comes to the market this year, will also have this stock. So if you want one, you can get it with this one. Um, still the same is the key mod. Um, they will also be changed to M-Lock and we will get rid of the Falke LE and put on the Falke S due to the fact that I prefer this one. I'm more the tube guy than rather the holographic one. So yeah, that will be the case. So if you're looking for a new AR-15, there will be 100 Schmeisser AR-15 in this configuration with the new M-Lock as well with the Falke L, uh, Falke S, which will come to the Swiss market and they will be number 200 up to 299. First come, first serve. So message me if you want one. Otherwise, these are the modifications I did. We have some little shooting videos, which we put in there. And then I'm gonna say thank you for watching our stuff once again. Hope to see you next time back here on the channel. See ya.
Hast du zwei vom Stein? Alter Mann. Alter Mann, ja. 